Hey, I'm Kelsey. Welcome to Everything Dolls. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that I created 12 dolls based on the birthstones. The month you were born in also has its own special flower. So yes, we're doing this again. Every month, I'm giving a doll a makeover based on the birth flower of the month. Let me know in the comments which month are you looking forward to seeing or if January is your month. Let's get started. The birth flower for January is carnation. This flower is very ruffly. The petals are really tight together and they also have crinkly edges. This is the doll I'm going to turn into carnation. She is the 2014 Triss Divergent Barbie Collector doll. She has a very sweet look to her face and I love her blue eyes. So while I give her a makeover, I'll tell you some facts about carnations. Carnations come in every color of the rainbow. You can buy them and find them in pretty much any color. The natural original color of a carnation is pale pink to pinkish purple. That's why I chose to do pink for this makeover. Each color has a different meaning. I'm using a blend of three different pink colors for her hair. Carnations are very hardy flowers. They can bloom in cold conditions, which a lot of flowers cannot do. So maybe if this is your birth flower, you can relate to this trait. You're very persistent and you have a lot of resilience and that means you're able to bounce back from the hard and difficult times in your life. Don't let the challenging moments ever define you. Another fact about pink carnation, for a lot of countries, they are the official flower for Mother's Day. So this is just your reminder, don't forget to give your mom some pink carnations this year. Carnation's scientific name is Dianthus cariophilus. Um, yes, I had to look up how to pronounce it, okay? Dianthus translates from Greek to divine flower, which I think is really pretty. To represent the frilly ruffles kind of of the petals, I'm going to curl the doll's hair. I'm using these pipe cleaners, chenille stems. You can also use this as a mini tutorial for curling your doll's hair too. This is my favorite method. It's really easy and I love how it turns out. All you do is wrap the strands of hair around the pipe cleaner, creating the curl, fold it at the bottom and top to keep it in place. And repeat that all around the doll's head. Once finished, you're going to dunk the hair into boiling water for seven seconds, three times. She doesn't fit into my mug here, but I'm just using this as an example. You can also use a pot of boiling water on the stove, and you want to let the hair air dry overnight. This is the most fun part, taking out the curls. You can also split them so they aren't as tight together, however you want to style them. There are some people out there that are carnation haters. They think it's a cheap flower. They associate it with funerals, which I completely disagree with. Especially if you look at the history of carnations. 
They're one of the oldest flowers out there, and I just don't think they deserve any hate. They're long lasting, they can last for up to a month if you take good care of them, and they smell so amazing. So please, if you ever run into a carnation hater, tell them otherwise because I just think this flower deserves way more love. So if this is your birth flower, it's another message for you. Don't ever worry about what others think of you. No matter what, somebody's gonna have an opinion. Whether they like you or not, it does not matter. Life is too short for that. Next, I'm styling this section of hair back and adding in a tiny carnation. Her made to move match is purple top and I'm giving her a quick hand swap with her old body. Next, I'm giving her fake pink nails. And lastly, she just needs her outfit. Her dress is pink with ruffles. It also has some sequins. I think it represents the flower carnation very well. I bought it from Hot Couture on Etsy. Her shoes are pink and I added tiny carnations on them. Lastly, she also needs a carnation to hold on to. Here is her before and after birth flower transformation. Be sure to leave a like for Carnation's makeover and share this video with someone you know that has a January birthday. The next flower is Violet for February, which is my birth month, so I'm excited. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe with notifications on if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I'm no damsel in distress. Come too close, I might just lose it. I like it down like